Hi guys, in this video I'm going to show you how these templates work. Now to the left we have our at core template showing our cable tray with all the fittings, reducers, uh, inverted, outside verticals, everything in this one cable tray. Now as you can see here this has been an issue, the profile Oh, don't have it there. Have to look into that. Now, this profile is based on our profiles, and I did it that way to match the systems tray. Now, we don't want to touch the systems tray because that's owned by Autodesk. Now, just going to slide over here and look at the MetSec template. Yeah, I downloaded this today, and this is what they use now. Here, I might have emailed this out. What they do over here. They adjust the cable tray size, actually change the size of the system family. Typically, I wouldn't want to do that, but if you guys want to do that, that's fine. Uh, so what they did here, I'll just show you. So here's their run, their, their, their sample run. I'll go on a 3D view, just to be fair with mine. Oops, sorry. So there's their 3D view of their cable runs. Now these cable tray, hmm, that's not right. And that's not right. Now this is the correct way to do this. This is a vertical inside. You see how it runs. This is outside and this is inside. These are not running the right way over here in this, this template. Okay, but anyway. And then, uh, hmm. so this is what they did here in this template. If you go to this tray, which is our, our pre-configured system tray, which is the equivalent to these that I have over here. These are the equivalents. And that's right, it's Unistrut, you. Uh, 15L3085, that's the 150, 3 meter, 850. Okay, now here, they just used one and they broke it out. And you could do that. I could do that over there too. But I don't know. My, small, my file is a lot smaller than this one for some reason, which is a good thing. Now, what they did here is if I go into the Manage tab, no, I'm sorry, on the Systems tab, here on the Cable Tray. And these are the, the settings that they use. See, they use this 342 here for the ladder. And that should be really a 300. Now, if I select this arrow right here, and I'll go down to Cable Tray Settings, and I'll go to Size, so right here, this is what happened. They changed all of the sizes in these cable tray to match up with their the, these families that I created here. Now these families are just basic generic families. I mean, if you want to do it this way, no problem. But I did send a model to the contractor. I think Nathan did and he approved it. Now send the one. I'm going to send you to him and see if he wants to prove that or we can do it this way. It's up to you guys. It doesn't really matter. The only reason why I did this is because this is our product. This is our cable tray. That's the 150, 125 depth. That's that one. And this is just a regular tray. Now, I can make that if you want. And then uh, the big issue, see, this is what this guy wants to do. This is what he wants more than anything. Now, I'm going to go over here, and I'm going to just say, I'll tell you what, let's fix these guys because these are wrong in this model. This this template is wrong. This is not how this should be. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to grab a good one, one of mine. I'm, in fact, I'm going to grab a few items out of here. Let's grab this one. Let's grab that. Let's get a T and a cross. And let's uh, paste the clipboard, copy the clipboard. And then let's go over here and paste it in in this model. Let's just paste it in here.
Okay. Now, those are in his model, in this model now. So now this guy is wrong. So the, when, they, when they say swap things out, this is basically all they're going to do here. They're going to basically, let's take, let's see, that's the outside. And this should be an outside, but it's an inside. So I'm going to grab this guy. And I'm going to go here. I'm going to just grab it. And I'm going to go find the one I just put in here. There it is right there. Bam. Oh, that's the wrong one. I want the inside one. There it is. So that's the correct fitting that should go there. Now let's fix this one. And this is all what he means when he swaps out. He probably doesn't care about anything but doing this. Because I think you mentioned to me that they're swapping out old to new. So this is all he wants to do. So, whoop, that's wrong. That should be this one. Uh, yeah, that is. So that's the that's the correct uh, tray fitting that should go there. Now, this situation here, I think it's more important to cover the inside, but... You know, we can fix that or we can just give them the regular things. Like I said, we do prefab in here at CNC where we need to know the exact sizes of the rungs, the depths, and the height. More detail here. That's what we use over here. Now, I'll do this cross here. They've got a cover on it, actually. So let's just swap out this T right here. So I'm going to get that guy. I'm going to swap it out to the one I put in. Uh, where's my T? Uh, is, did I bring one in? Yeah, there it is. Let me see. Where is it? Okay. That's it right there. So I'm going to swap this guy out with mine with the new one. And there you go. Again, this is not correct. See, a lot of this stuff in this thing I downloaded from Med, uh, what is this? MedSec is not right. But when he wants to swap stuff out, this is what he wants to do. He wants to be able to pick this guy here, replace it with, say, the right one, which is this. That's the one that should be in there. And also, in this one, we did not, let me show you this one now. Over in this one, if I go to Manage tab, I'm sorry, I go to Systems tab and go here and press the little arrow. Cable tray size. We didn't change the size of the tray at all. We're leaving it at the original size now. I don't know why they're doing that. Uh, it's because of this issue. Now, as far as class detection, that's not an issue because they can isolate that out. That's a small thing. But if you, like I said, if you want that, you can have it. Uh, let's see what's going on here. Any more things we need to fix over here? There's another one. See, that's not right. So let's grab him. Let's swap it out. So guys, the uh, this, 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 there you go. That's it. That's where it should be. Now this tray I'm going to send you here, I would send this over and see if they approve this or if they want to do this. Um... That's all I'm saying, you know, we over here, now here, I'll do this bin as well. I'll change this, so I'll swap that out to, wait a second, let me grab this. I'll swap it out. Uh, no. I'm in the wrong file. Do I have it? No, I don't have any. So let me take one and bring it over just to show you this. Let's just grab this one here. I wanna, I wanna come over here. This is what he means when he says swap. Because when I heard him say swap, oh, they just wanna replace something with ours and it's just routable. He means, can he do this? Can he do a run? Okay, say, can he do this? And we can do this here. Let's go with the wrong file here. Mm. 
And it's still hot dips. Okay, I don't know what's going on here. Is that in there? Yeah. But anyway, I'm gonna leave it here. And 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 basically, this is uh, I think this is what they want. Um, and here's the run here I've got here. I got all of your fittings and everything here, and I'll go and do a few more. Now, if you want to use this, you can, but a lot of these are not correct. We went and like, there's another one. Let me take this. Let me see what this is. No, see, that's not right. So let's go and replace him so we can go here and swap this guy out. This would be a outside. There you go. Okay. And this is wrong as well. So uh, I don't know how I feel about using this. It's old and the way they're doing it. So I would go and right away immediately today before I get in. I might be able to go and find out if this is what this contractor wants to do. So I just swapped out my tray. Now this, again, this is just our profile. And it's like that just to match up with the system tray. Over here, they changed it around. To match it if I change in the, num the number of the trade. So anyway, I'm going to leave it here, guys. Thanks for watching. And I just want to give you a brief demonstration of what's going on here. I think this is what they're after. I mean, if we can do it this way, but these are just generic, straightforward cable tray. And they just renamed them and gave them material. So have a look at this and let me know what you guys, your thoughts. Talk to you soon. Bye.